Hi, I'm Kirsten. And I'm Serenity, and we're the founders of the Open Food Network. The food system currently is controlled uh, by a small number of very large players. Basically, they're making all the money out of what I'm, mm. what I'm growing. You know, I do all the work, and they, they reap, reap the rewards. Our challenges in distribution uh, are information, and information about this diffuse marketplace. The administration doing a lot of the back ends and a lot of the ordering and, and how we go about collating orders and payments. Um, so we started looking for what kind of software and solutions might be around to actually help enable these hubs and these local food networks. Um, and we looked at a whole range of things all around the world. And what we found is that there, what we were looking for didn't exist. The system doesn't actually work if you don't have the middlemen because it's actually quite complex getting food from the farm gate to the customers in a way that's convenient and affordable. Customers come online and are able to browse the offers of a whole lot of independent stores, independent shops, independent offers and find what suits them because convenience is different for different people. No matter who that customer buys through, they can see back to the farmer so they can read about how the food was grown, they can find out the price that the farmer got. So it enables this transparency in the supply network. We've now got a really highly competent core tight development team and great designers. So we're feeling really confident about actually that we can do this, we've got the right people in place. It's already shown that it can help us so much with administration and save a lot of time. It's going to really close the gap between the consumer and the farmer. It allows us to play in our own community, but it also allows us to play in a broader marketplace when it suits us. People all over the world are finding the Open Food Network and are wanting to contribute to it and it's getting all of this momentum which is very exciting for us. It's not just a nice thing to do to make it work for farmers. If we don't have farmers into the future we don't have food so it's fundamental that it works for them and it's fundamental that it enables them to grow food in a sustainable regenerative way. So that's the future that we want to see.